With all of the artifacts and equipment Hydra has been absconding with, it was inevitable we'd catch them unloading equipment somewhere. You'll have to move quickly if we're going to recover any of their equipment. You're the boss. Shit, son. I'm impressed. had your chance to escape. I see not much has changed among the world's fanatics. One of the crates. See if you can't get the others. As ordered. Not good enough. Sorry, Major. Regroup and await reinforcements. Serve her with honor. You're gonna need a few. They've armed one of the crates. Going to explode if you don't get that key. Get it. 
getting better every day. You've secured one of the crates. See if you can't get the others. Hey, that's gonna be fun. of the crates is armed to detonate. Get to that key card. I'll put this to good use. We can do this together. Just like old times. That was the last crate. Wipe out the remaining Hydra forces. Get you home. Somehow. to their reputation. Welcome assistance. Get out of there! You're gonna like this! 
Centuries ago. This should be good. Walk in the light. That should help. Her corruption spreading. Your fate is sealed. Weak, even for Hydra. shipment Hydra won't be receiving. Can you help me out? Hola! Hey Hunter! Parker and I cooked something up, and we think you should be a part of it. Oh, you know, if, if you're free. I could be free. Right on. Then let's head over to the shop and... Ah, oops. Almost spoiled the surprise. Uh, tell you what, if you come with me, just for a bit, I promise we won't waste your time.
All right. Where are we headed? Oh, it's not too far. I can't wait till you see it. Hey, you made it! Told you. You want to give the rundown, or should I? I got this. Welcome to the shop. What is this place? For me, it's a piece of home away from home. Quite a setup. What need does it fulfill? All kinds. Usually, I work on the Hell Ride, and Parker tinkers with his web gadgets. And as we do, we brainstorm ideas of what we could work on together. You call it the shop, but I see nothing for sale. That's the beauty. For me, it's an auto shop. For Parker, it's a workshop. We're both wondering what it's going to be for you. There must be a reason you do this here instead of the Forge. Two reasons. Tony Stark and Doctor Strange. We wanted a place with good vibes and less bickering. Where we could focus on a project without the smartest men in the world telling us how to do it better. The shop is where you work things out for yourself. I understand why the two of you are here, but why invite me? Caretaker always described you as someone who worked with their hands. You made things. You did the work. So we want to make things with you. Help you do the work. You two are so thoughtful. Where do I start? Wherever you want. Why not let Parker give you a quick rundown on our current project? After that, we'll close up the shop. All right. It's all pretty neat, huh? There's not enough here to give you a tour, but I did want to show off our first project. Don't have a name for this yet, but if you run into Eddie again, uh, Venom, we think this could give you an edge. When we fought Eddie, the symbiote reacted strongly to your presence. It noticed something about you and tensed up. Our project takes advantage of this. This project of yours, what does it do? Our first prototype dulls your presence around the symbiote. Makes you harder for Eddie to notice. So, a uh, symbiote muffler? Ha! <laughs> it is now. The other prototype will help if you're ever caught in Eddie's tendrils. It blasts a distracting subsonic pulse that should give you time to both fight your way out and hit him with a counter. Like your zingers that keep him distracted? You know, Robbie and I should let you name all our projects. Then we need to miniaturize it so it fits in your suit, but we could have it ready pretty quick. I look forward to seeing it in action. I knew you'd be into this! We are going to make so many weird things together. Oh yeah, I can scrounge enough components to finish this project, but if there were more, we'd have more options. I'll put together a list and send it to your spark. Bring what you can next time you're here. All right. So, how'd it turn out? Better than expected. Sick. So, that's the shop. What do you think? 
You and Parker have outdone yourselves. Then think of what the three of us can do. I'll give you a heads up before shop class meets again. Shop class? Right. That's what we're calling our time here. See you then. Parker, you sticking around? You're asking me if I'm sticking around? Ha! <laughs> Walked into that one. Like a spider web? What do you say? Dude. Don't make me roll up a newspaper. Not many of those left. Good. It's good to have you around again. And watching the way you handle yourself out there, Hunter. You're not bad. I was thinking maybe it's time you and I compare moves. Moves? As in combat? More like a friendly competition. A friendly competition, you say? Well, recently resurrected teammate competition has less of a ring to it. The feeling is mutual, Blade. How about we just fight already? Before we begin, is there anything else I should know? Yeah, anything goes. Just don't touch the shades. Now you want to say it or me? Say what? Ding ding. Thanks, Hunter. Still can't believe all these changes happening with Eddie. Uh, the Venom symbiote. Not sure if you know this, but I used to wear that thing. I mean, it was hard enough when it was just an alien, but now... I'm pretty sure that green fire would have really cooked the old spider keister. Having that creature inside of your head must have been difficult. You would think so, but to be honest, I didn't even know the suit was alive until the end. It's more like I felt urges, impulses. To do what? Use my power. Like, really use it. No holding back. But, at the end of the day, I was the one still in charge. Any decision I made during that time is a hundred percent on me. So you are defending the carnivorous alien monster that is trying to devour your brain? <sighs> you want to know the first real feelings I ever sensed from that thing? Fear. 
As soon as I tried to pull it off for good, it was pure terror at the thought of being alone. That doesn't sound like a monster to me. I had not thought about it that way. Why it chose to bond with a shifty reporter from the metro section after that is beyond me. I still cannot imagine you wearing the symbiote. My design was a bit more classic than Eddie's or your mother's. All things aside, I look pretty cool in that thing. Been thinking about bringing it back. The design, not the cannibalistic alien symbiote. I have something for you. Oh, a hot tip on a rent control department in Queens? Components for shop class. Eh, almost as good. You are one of the most agile people I have ever seen. Peter Parker, awesome dude. Says it on my business card. Blade, can we speak in private? Is it about the chore wheel? Because I'm not swapping. No, it is not about that. Good. Everyone knows how I feel about dish duty. Nico needs help prepping for a magic surprise party. No. Hell no. I thought you were close with magic. I am. That's why I won't do it. I told Nico, and I'll tell you. Magic skims the last chapter of a mystery before starting the book. The woman does not like surprises. Do you know why she dislikes surprises? Does she need a reason? That's how she is. It sounds like she would want to know about the party. Might not go over well with Nico, but Magic would appreciate it. That's your call. Is there anyone else who could help prep for the party? Outside the Midnight Suns? That Parker kid has way too much energy. May as well put it to good use. Thanks, Blade. For what? Kid's annoying. You'd be doing me a favor by keeping him off my back. Do half vampires need sunblock? Can your fangs drain a cream-filled cake? If we bite each other, would we have the same powers? It just... it never ends. Good to see you, Hunter. Hunt. Do you have time to speak in private? Are you firing me? Am I getting fired? No. Why would you ask that? I don't know. I panicked. Uh, sure. Let's talk. Nico needs help prepping for Magic Surprise Party. Really? She asked for me? She asked for Blade, but he is busy. Oh. So Blade thinks I can fill his vamp-kicking boots? He said if you are busy, you will stop bothering him. Uh, Daredevil said the same thing when we first met, but he came around. We're buds now. We hang. I do most of the talking, but... 
So is that a yes? Sure. I'm the new guy. I get it. How can I pitch in? She needs help decorating the party room. I can tape balloons to the ceiling while standing on it. I am so in. kids for life. How does this look? Find more coil, send it my way.
If you can beat Carol in a straight fight, I'll let you skip training. Good luck with that. My lucky day, huh? Let's do it. Back again. We need any advantage we can get. Hunter, do you have enough? Hydra thinks they're so clever. Just imagine if they actually were. They might be in trouble. to escape, do whatever it takes to stop it before it departs. We don't have much time. Take down anyone in your path and stop that helicopter. We'll handle it post-haste. Getting chewed up here! That was really something. for you. Ah, main 
course has arrived. Keep it up. Let's give it a go. The light shines on the most dutiful. This is one of the stronger arms. We did come all the way here for a fight. goes if at first we don't succeed. This is getting old. Looks like they want to try a few more. I should get you going. The helicopter is preparing for takeoff. We still have some time. Make sure you don't ignore it. did the helicopter. Excellent. Now you'll need to clean up the rest of Hydra's forces. Really, I'm flattered, but save some for the others. Hell of a move. 
use a hand. They haven't put up much of a fight yet. About time. These fanatics are always the same. Shouldn't take too long. Get ready. Impressive. It's on. my fight. Emo kids are meeting tonight. You in? Lead the way. And the emo kids are back for another deep dive into the night of your death. When can we start? Soon. Strange asked to lead tonight's meeting. He's prepping the... Ugh, I, I don't know what exactly. It involves a lot of weird math. While he's preparing his, um, the theorems, I guess? You should talk to Magic. She'll explain how we use ingredients. You received my message, yes? About the ingredients? Yes, but I came up short. This is fine. I also hate scavenging. Remember, ingredients make mystical trinkets. Excess trinkets go to you. I will provide a new list for the next meeting. Check your spark tomorrow. <sighs> Enough about ingredients. I said more words than strange. Has he prepared yet? I have plans for after. What plans? Solitary plans. 
All my preparations are complete. And now for a thorough explanation of this week's delicate divinations. However, Miss Minoru insisted I provide a summary, if you request it. Did Miss Rasputin make a request? And a gesture? Neither which bear repeating? Summarize, please. We do the same as before, but this time we zap you with more mystical power. That is it? <sighs> That's it. Shall we begin? Go ahead. Where do your memories last leave off? I was running through the Abbey grounds. Good. Now, focus. And now, wake your mind from slumber. I burst into the clearing, expecting an army. Instead, I find her. She sits at the center of a muddy circle. For a moment, I wonder if she sleeps. Tell us, Hunter. Tell us who you see. I see the mother of demons. Herald of the Manifold Dream. She who tends what dwells beneath. I see Lilith. I see... I, I see my... Ugh! What's happening here? What, you, you got a spidey sense too? I was taking a walk. I heard the chanting. Crap, I messed up the binding formula. As I most definitely told you, lemon scented is no replacement for actual lemon. What exactly is going on? The hunter's resurrection, though miraculous, was incomplete. We're attempting to restore a rather crucial set of memories. How Hunter killed Lilith the first time. You're not mad, are you? I'm not mad. But next time you do this, I'd like to observe. Of course! Next time. We should have invited her. Quiet, you. You are definitely making progress. How are you feeling? I am fine. About Caretaker? Uh, we never invited her because it seemed cruel to make her relive your death. I would have preferred to spare her the details, but now she knows. You're right. If we can't figure out how you defeated Lilith the first time, there's little chance it could happen again. I'll speak with her before the next meeting, smooth things over. And with that, we're done for the day. You leaving? That is it for me. Sounds good. See you next meeting. Nice shirt. We need to talk. Yes? Nothing. Never mind. Okay. Hello. Thank you. 
The tower bells are ringing. My favorite childhood prank. But I have not heard them in so long. The caretaker must be wincing right now. Or maybe this was her idea of a joke. Hello, Hunter. Is there something I can help you with? You were looking at me funny. Was I? Huh. You read me so well. I was just thinking about how much you remind me of Lilith when she was young. You have never really spoken of her before. I guess I don't like to dredge up old memories. Especially the painful ones. What was my mother like when she was younger? Better than me, that was for sure. She was the brave one, kind and courageous. Everyone loved her. Me, most of all. So you can imagine how hard it was for me when she... sold her soul. I'm so sorry you went through that. Losing a sister could not have been easy. It wasn't. But I imagine it must be harder for you. I lost a sister, but you lost your mother. I was just a baby when it happened. Still, I know it affects you. She had everything going for her. Everything. Beauty, brains, talent, compassion. She could have done anything, and she just threw it all away for power. What a waste. We should have been a family. I suppose we have each other. Yes. Yes, we do. And for now, that is enough. Could we speak in private? Will this lead to the two of us shouting at one another? I cannot see how. Then, yes. Nico needs help prepping for a magic surprise party. A surprise party? Have you met magic? Why do you say that? Oh, just a feeling. What does Nico want from me? Can you handle the cake? Of course. The trick will be hiding the icing. Magic's sweet tooth can lead her to cupcakes at 50 paces. have you brought me today? To be fair, it does look interesting, at least. Started right away. 
an undeniable essence of power. Farewell. You know, I really could do just as well without you loitering back there. How are I'm happy to help, Hunter. This should be useful. This will do nicely. You know I know magic, right? got me thinking about forming a team of my own. Spider-Man and his astonishing pals. His stupendous companions. I'm circling it, I know. <laughs> 